Hello everyone, Tech1421 here with some more Captain Toad. In the last episode, we took on Dragon's Revenge, and it was over a month since I played this game. That was a one, uh, January 18th, 2015. When I'm recording this now, it is January, or February 22nd, so it's been quite a long time, but nonetheless, we're going to go ahead and hop right into level 210, Spinwheel Cog Ruins. And we have Captain Toadette here. here we defeated Dragons, so there's a little bit of a boss level. And alright, what do we do here? We, uh... Oh, my aim is off. Clearly. And we missed that guy both times. Alright, let's try doing this. What does that do? Does it do anything? Do I see anything? Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. So now we can go this way. Run, Captain Toadette! And do I... I should probably look for the diamonds first off. So there's a diamond there. There's a diamond there. And that's all I see. Anything over here? I don't see any other diamonds. Um, it could be in that pipe. It could be at the very bottom. The, the purple pipe could lead to the very bottom of the map. That's where I'm guessing the last one is. Alright. Good to know. Alright, so we just pluck these for some more... Some more gold. Can we stun these guys? We can. So I'm gonna continue to stun this guy and run this way. I don't think that's cheating or anything, right? They probably put that in the game for a reason. Uh, Alright, so let's go ahead and get that diamond. And I'll stun this guy again. Wait. Alright, my aim's off. I have to get off the platform, that's why. Stun him and run! Stun and run! <laughs> and turn these these wheels. Cool, we got our first- oh, that's our second diamond. Alright, our first one's by spinning that thing, so let's do that. So now we have to go all the way back over here. Stun this guy again, yeah! Alright, and when you st I, does, when you stun that guy, does it stun all of them? Just, just so I know. No, it only stuns him, okay. Um, let's spin this wheel again, and that should give us our first diamond on top of that platform over there. Alright. Stun the sky and run by him. Cool. Doing a pretty good job so far. I feel like a pro at this game right now, I must say. Alright, so that was, that was our first diamond. Um, I wonder if we can... I don't think we can jump that far. But we can jump off here. And can we get those... Yeah, we can get those coins. And take this way back up. That's kind of a, a different way to get by this person right here. Uh, there's a turn up to stun him a little bit more. And now let's go ahead and move this wheel. And what does this do? Is this is this to get to the other side here? Let's see how much how what can we get out of this? Um, I don't think that does anything for us, to be honest. Let's continue to spin it. See if there's like some kind of pattern we can get to. It doesn't do anything either. Nope. What about that? No. That, okay, that will that will do us some good, I think. Yeah. Alright, so I think we have to go back... Over... Over here. So let's stun this guy. Oh. Let's stun him on the other side. Stun him and run! And now we have to... Which platform do we need? I think we're fine on that particular dial. We need to move the one over here. Alright. That's probably why I wanted to just get that other one second. Or the other one first. Alright, so we move this one right, and that should line up perfectly. Let's see if we can run by this guy without getting hit. And not having to stun him. Okay, that's pretty easy actually. We might just, we might just want to stun them anyways, because it's just less risky. <laughs> but, alright, so we drop down here. And then we go up here, and can we just drop down? I think we just drop down, right? Yeah. Cool. And we can take the staircase, the ladder up, to get this uh, star right there, but we don't want to do that. So we want to bypass this guy, and bypass this guy, and bypass this guy, one by one. Anything over here? I don't think so. And then we'll just go to the bottom right here, and there's Blue Toad. And, oh, let's get all these coins. I'm pretty sure Blue Toad will probably give us the diamond. Yes, he does. Awesome. Thank you, Blue Toad. We're trying to save your brother, good old Captain Toad. 
Uh, he got caught by Wingo. We got caught by Wingo before, but now he's caught by Wingo. Monkey C, Monkey Do, or Toad C, Toad at Do, or no, ah, uh, whatever. <laughs> I tried. Um, okay. Oh boy, that was really close. Run, and run, and alright, go over here. And this over here looks really suspicious, I see some coins. I think we're gonna go over here and just see these coins for ourselves. Alright, now I don't know what the hidden achievement is. Because there wasn't anything that really stood out, there wasn't anything that we really had to get. I feel like there's probably like a golden, like, mushroom or something at the bottom in these one of these pits. But we're gonna just go ahead and get the the star regardless. But who knows, we might have just be in the level without taking any damage or something. Uh, found, found the hidden golden mushroom, who called it? Alright, so now I have to actually find it, because... I have no idea where it is. Um, this might be a little difficult to find, but we're gonna find it. We're gonna try our best. Now, my first reaction is that it might be at the bottom here. So let's just jump down and just keep pressing A. Is my first reaction to this thing. And just press A everywhere, right? And if it's not here, then... Um, is it right here? Is this it? No. I thought I had something right here. Nope. Alright. Okay, so it's not there. Um, now where do I... Oh, is it down? It's, oh, it has to be down there. It has to be. There's no doubt in my mind. No doubt in my mind at all. Over here. It, there's no- there has- yes, there it is. Right there. There's the golden mushroom. Okay, cool, we found it. Now we have to get back to... <laughs> now I have to turn on these dials again. Alright, so how do we do that before? Is it like that? Alright. And now we bypass that guy. Wow, that was really close. And now... This way... We need that one like that. Very good. Turn up! Stun him. <laughs> Okay, now we go this way. Can we just actually jump down there? No, I don't think so. Alright. These are just coins though, right? Yeah. And run! And then we turn this one... How do we do that? Was it like this? Yes. Okay, cool. So now I have to go back. There we go. Go on by that that guy. I don't know the, I don't know the name of those those enemies. I already got that diamond, and now we just jump down here, and go over here, and we are golden, we're solid, okay. Climb the ladder, and let's actually go for 100 coins, because we're so close. Can we get 100 coins? I don't think we can. We're really close. It'd be nice to get another life. Um, it's fine, it's not really worth it. <laughs> so we got 93 coins, it is what it is. There's more at the very bottom of the level. If we could have gotten that, but course clear, 100%. We got the golden mushroom, and that is 100% on Spin Wheel Cog Ruins. Very fun little level, very neat level design. I, I like that level a lot. That was really cool. Someone dropped something in the apartment above me. Don't know what that was. Uh, we have three levels that unlocked from that, but we're only going to tease the next level here. Um, and, and if you watch this one, you'll find out what the other ones are. But Wind Up Stairs is the next level. Oh boy, I see I see some fun little things going on there. Some might be a little bit of a challenging level, but that is 100% on level 10. Spin the wheel, spin wheel, cog ruins. If you did enjoy, please leave a like. That'd be greatly appreciated. And we'll see everyone next time with Spin Up Stairs, level 11. See you next time. Peace.